What's going on? We're back with another full day eating video where I'm showing you every single day what I eat start to finish. No processed foods, no fake meats, no tofu, no salad, and yes, this is a vegan diet. Let's show them the, ooh, buddy, looking stupid shredded year round. If your goal is to lose weight, if your goal is to put on muscle, if your goal is to be healthy, this is the right channel for you because you can do it all under the same umbrella. You just scale the meals up if you wanna put on weight, Scale the meals down if you wanna lose weight. Pretty simple. So straight out the bat, we're going with a chia seed pudding, which has chia seeds, cashew yogurt, high quality maple syrup, everything's high quality, everything is organic, vanilla extract, and some frozen fruit on top. Typically I like to start my mornings with fruit, but I ate all the fruit this week, so I sadly do not have any fruit. And I'm going into some overnight oats. This is a blended overnight oat, which just means I take all the overnight oat ingredients, put it in the blender before I pour it in the mason jars. I just prefer the texture that way. We change our flavors every couple weeks. This one is a banana cream pie. Funny name, I know, I'm not gonna make that joke again though. There is banana in here. There is chia seeds, oats obviously, hemp seeds, peanut butter, almond milk, for our almond milks that we use as well, it is homemade, but you do not have to do that. You can, in the store, buy the ones that don't have the sunflower seed oil or any seed oils in there. That's just our preference. A lot of people, that's the hype lately, is the seed oil, the seed oil. And yeah, I'm sure it's not that great, but like I think they're overblowing it. The same way with intermittent fasting, that's like the trend over the past few years. And that is what I do by nature, but I think it's more important what you eat rather than when you eat. So if you wake up and you're hungry, eat, okay? That's the way I see it. I think the fasting thing is a fad. The sunflower seed oil, I get it. It's not healthy. I personally do avoid it, but the overblowing of that, it's like focus on eating nutritious meals. If you have a freaking snack bar that has some seed oil, I'm pretty sure you're gonna be fine. And when I say processed foods, I avoid it for my main meals. Once again, there's a you'll see in these videos, I haven't in these past 20 that I've posted, but there's times where I'll grab a cliff bar or something, and you know, it's a processed food, so it is what it is. I don't get super neurotic about things. I just prefer to eat this way. I feel better. And when you eat high carbs and healthy do and healthy, delicious, nutritious foods like these to start your morning, you just don't crave that kind of weird snack stuff, especially when you add fruit in there. That high sugar, the high carbs, you're really satisfied and you don't crave the nasty foods, especially when you've been doing it for so long. I've been vegan for nine years, been in shape for 13 years. So four years I was doing the standard bodybuilding diet. So when people come at me like, you would be better off with meat, it's like, I did that. I feel better without that. So that's why I'm making these videos because the vegan community kind of has a weird soy boy and like negative connotation to it. I'm trying to show you, you could be the flyest motherfucker on earth. You can be shredded year round. You can be a real man in this community and it's not feminine to be vegan. It's actually more masculine because people talking about, you need that cholesterol. It's like, dude, don't you know all that cholesterol makes your dick soft? Motherfucker. <laughs> If, you, if you're this far in the video, you know, you can hear a little bit of a raunchiness because I'm the realest one on earth. I'm showing you the realness on these videos. I'm not a commercial, oh, 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 like a lot of these people are. I'm, this is like the real shit right here. So following up with that, I'm showing you guys my multivitamins. I do not take bodybuilding supplements. I take health supplements. It's not a vegan exclusive thing. I've had the blood work done over the years. I've had phenomenal blood work. Thank you. Yeah, healthiest motherfucker on earth. Uh, yeah. But over the past year and a half, I decided, you know, I want to optimize, want to up my game because you should always be finding ways to up your game. And I decided that I'm going to go with the highest quality supplements, which Thorne is known to be third party tested, high quality supplements, multivitamin, magnesium. I get magnesium in the vitamins. I get magnesium in my food. And I also get all of the vitamins in my food as well. You know, despite what people like to say, you don't get DHA. It's like, all right, bud, thank you for that. Why don't you focus on yourself? Another brand I really like to use is Organics Nature, black seed oil, and Irish sea moss. 
look up the benefits for everything that I'm giving you here. I'm not going to sit here and go through every single video. Alpha Brain is another product I really enjoy taking. So yeah, I do take five pills every morning. Oh my God. But it's not a vegan exclusive thing. It's just something that a healthy athlete should do. I'm a high performing athlete. Go to my Instagram, E-W-O-J-Z, E-W-O-J-Z. Or go to my shorts and you can see some of those videos on there as well. I'm a high performing athlete. I not only weight lift five days a week, but I train like a savage. Just watch my stuff. Obviously there's only seven days in a week. So that means that I have to double up somewhere and twice a week I do two a days. So I'm training six days a week. I'm doing two a days, two of those days. So I'm really high performing. So if you're sitting on your couch, sitting there like, why do you need a vitamin? Come on, like learn some game. That's the point of these videos. It's not just for me to sit here and have fun. It's I've been doing this for almost 10 years now on the vegan side and 13 years on the fitness side. I feel like it's time. It's time for me to actually give this information out. Do you know how excited I was when I first turned vegan? The first year or two, I, w I was making videos. Like if you go to my channel, I unlisted a lot of them, but there's a couple that I put up. Six years ago, I posted a video, something like that, six, seven years ago. Like I was excited to make these videos, but clearly the growth is there. You can go back and look. I wasn't doing it the same. I was picking up restaurant foods and showing you guys like this is now to a point where it's so dialed in that I truly believe it's the highest level on the internet. I, I failed to see anybody else like we're talking about competing with professional chefs at this point and it's not realistic when you're doing that. The everyday person isn't going to make these professional chef meals. My girlfriend and I are two full-time working people who work hard at high performing jobs. And then on top of that, we're both hitting the gym six days a week because she's training with me. High level, busy, 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 busy people. And then we're still fitting all this in and I'm also making videos every day. So that's a task in itself. So it's very doable. That is the point of these videos. So we'll see you here for meal number two. I gotta go get some work done. I'm running around, gotta do all type of shit, you know? You see, I'm fly today, so it's not like the, well, it is physically blue collar day today, right? But it's not as blue collar as typical because I am a hardworking blue collar, self-employed man. Yeah, America, all right? So let's give him a flex. Look, dude, stupid shredded. God damn. All right, we'll see you here in a minute. <laughs> This is a staple at this point. I've been showing you guys, you know, hey, spray on some opportunity. I know this isn't the most healthy thing in the world to do. People don't like fragrance, like, oh, it's so unhealthy. But if your diet isn't optimized, you ain't even gotta worry about that type of shit because you're consuming more chemicals than what you're gonna spray on. That's why I like high quality stuff like this Lilabo, the Nor 29. This is all, you know, legal and safe and FDA compliant. So it's can't be the worst thing ever. I know it's not the greatest, don't get me wrong. This is a sample that I have right here, boom, boom. But for my birthday, which is tomorrow, so wish me a happy birthday in comments. By the time this video gets posted, I've already turned 30 years old. Yeah, I know I don't look it, buddy. It's because I have a vegan diet, brother, for a decade. So I do have a full bottle coming for my birthday tomorrow, which I'm excited about. We'll see you here momentarily. All right, we're back for dinner post-gym two a days today back in biceps followed by ninja training that's like five hours worth of work baby Woo! oh and we work in full time ain't no excuses yeah instant pot meal tonight missy chrissy prepared for us you will see an overshot view We have some coconut black bean stew. Miss Chrissy is gonna let us know what the hell is in this coconut black bean stew. In the stew is onion, garlic, ginger, bell pepper, red chili pepper, black beans as the name suggests, sweet potatoes, coconut milk, and it's served over top of coconut rice. Ooh. Recipe in the description. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Delicious, nutritious, high calories if you eat 50 bowls, 
low calories if you eat one bowl. High protein regardless, getting all your nutrition in, absolutely lovely. I just, it blows my mind when you eat this clean and people still have a comment. It's been about a week now that I've had any negative comments, but inevitably people are going to come here and ignorantly hate on the vegans. It completely blows my mind. If they were to just actually watch the video and have an open mind, they could see truly how healthy the diet is, especially when you do it right. That's what I'm here to show you. Change the face of the game, baby. Change what it means to be a vegan. You should look like a fucking hoss, all right? I'm getting fired up from all that plant protein. Woo! <laughs> Got him, corny. We will see you tomorrow for another full day eating video. It will be my birthday tomorrow. By the time this video gets posted, my birthday would have already passed. Yeah. We'll see you tomorrow.